Hello everyone, Niav here, and today I am going to go through the December 2023, which is Moonbox. Um, uh, I've said in past uh, videos that I've stopped getting this box, and I have. It's just that I've put my subscription on hold for three months, um, and cause, because that's as long as it, it will allow you to do. Um, but I often forget uh, to redo the pause for another three months, so uh, basically every three months I've <laughs> been getting a box. So this is the box for this month. All right. So um, I've already pulled everything out, of course. Um, and let's see. The theme this month is Empire of Oracles. Very nice. We get two sheets of um, information right here and right here. And then a third sheet for like petition work. I, I cannot seem to get the papers apart. There we go. And a sh third sheet for like petition work, uh, spell work, whatever you want to use it for, uh, which is great. Um, I do wish they would do these front and back though, <laughs> just to waste less paper, but that's just me. <laughs> All right. And I've got my personalized Oracle card. I think it goes this way. Yes. Oh, very nice. Cave of echoes. Can you hear the echo of, uh, can you hear the echo of music in Fingal's Cave Within? Is this Irish? I want to see what deck this is from. Um, let's see. The parchment personalized oracle reading. It is from Druid Wisdom. Okay, I see. Uh, inspiration deck by An Andres uh, Ingracia. Um, yeah, okay. I'll, I'll have to look up that deck. Uh, it's one of those, um, mini decks, the ones that are, uh, long and skinny like this. It's very pretty. Um, I think I've had that on my list for a little bit, uh, that deck. All right, so the artwork, which I think is the best part of these boxes, and it's kind of why I kept, um, kept getting this box for, like, two years before I finally, ooh, excuse me, before I finally, uh, stopped my, uh, subscription um so this is on the rowan tree very nice i like that a lot and we do see oem here the oracle card was oem and the next piece is oem so i'm actually really excited um i i love oem um as a divination system as um a system in, of irish paganism it's definitely my sort of thing so um i am actually really of all the boxes to accidentally get um this is probably the uh, one of the best ones for me so rowan tree and ash tree um the dog's gonna run in here barking because there's someone walking by so sorry if um she starts barking and of course i just showed this one but it is um it's a thing of the om staves hold on sorry about that <laughs> you know the dog <laughs> um but yeah this is beautiful it says om right here on the top um and it's got the uh the different letters here, uh, along with uh, just some a few key words on what they could represent. Um, I don't know exactly if these line up with my personal um, associations. I, I like to use the associations uh, that Morgan Daimler um, uh, provides for people. Sorry about the dog. Um, yeah, so Morgan Daimler's uh, interpretation of the OM um, is definitely uh, the method that I lean toward. Um, so yeah, but that is very nice. I like that a lot. All right. So we do have, um, we've got one big item here that I'll go ahead and show. Um, it is some sort of case, a vessel of some sort that's got a lid. It's wooden, um, uh, very pretty artwork all around it. Um, very simple. I like it. Very nice. Um, and I'm pretty sure I know what it's going to hold because there's this big bag of goodies. They put all of the herbs, the incenses, the, the other big item in here. So, um, which I already know what it is. Um, I can see it from, from the bag, but yeah. All right, so I'm going to start pulling some stuff out and we'll look through it. All right, so we have, oh, some pine cones. All right, that's interesting. Little mini pine cones. All right then. <laughs> Um, all right, so this is birch tree, uh, because it's beh, and then, uh, wild berry bark. Interesting. And then we have pine, oh, peel lime, peel lime. I thought that said pine. Peel lime. All right, so those are the herbs. Great. Then we have the incense, and this is pine man. I like that. Um, so I do like the smell of pine. I like that there's a, like, a green man on the 
thing, which by the way, is not Irish. Uh, and I know this deck, this, uh, this box is not specifically Irish, but yeah, it definitely smells like pine. It smells good. I like it. <laughs> Sorry about the dog. She like waits until I have a camera on and then she's like, okay, I'm going to bark at everyone in the neighborhood. All right. So the next, next one up here is the oil. Oh, my hands are so cold. Um, unfortunately, my ritual room, uh, which is where I'm at right now, um, it's not insulated. And I live in New England. So um, it's like the entire winter, which is like half the year, this room is practically unusable. Um, I do. I had a space heater um, that didn't do a very good job. We just got another one that's a bit different. And it's right behind me, so it's warming up my back, but my, my hands are just like freezing. All right, so this says Merry Meat Anointing Oil. Nice. Let me see if I what it smells like. Let me open it up. Oh, it smells nice. All right, I can see if we can have, see if the camera focuses a little bit and we can see uh, it's not wanting to focus. All right, but there's some, there's some goodies in there floating around. <laughs> All right. All right, next up we have... Um, oh, a stone. Let's see what this is. Ooh, that's pretty. Look at that stone. It's like a uh, dark green and a little bit of like um, oranginess to it. Let me see if I can find what the stone is in the paperwork. Um, so Yule pine cones. Oh, where is this? Oh, African jade. Okay, that's what it is. African jade. Interesting. I do like that. That's very pretty. All right, African Jade. All right, next up, I'm going to move around the big item here. Uh, we have our candle. Let's see what this one is. Oh, this is wrapped a bit differently. Ah, here we go. Okay, and it is orange. Nice. It's an orange candle. All right. Next up, we have our Sacred Salt, and it is Whispers of Winter. Hmm. Nice. There's a lot of green in this. Like, so it's, it's really mixed in with some herbs here. All right. And the final item, the big item, the one that I think is going to go inside this container here are some ohm staves. Um, so I'm really excited about this. I do already have, uh, I actually have two sets of ohm staves. Um, and I'll bring them over so that you can, uh, see what they look like. Oh my God. My fingers are like icicles right now. Okay. And we get it out of here. We'll just put it right in here. Okay, nice. And let me grab my other my other set so we can see what it looks like. Okay, so this is my other set here. And um, this is, I can't remember the name of the Etsy shop that I got this from. And this is actually my second deck of this. Because the first one, um, well, actually... <laughs> I ordered, uh, my husband ordered this for me for my birthday for one year, um, probably about 10 years ago. And uh, when the package arrived, it was empty and there was a note from the postal service saying they couldn't send it because it was it contained like live material or something. It, it was a lot of the bark and stuff. So I think maybe some of the bark was coming out of the packaging and they shredded the package or uh, they shredded the contents of the package and let me know. And I had to, uh, hand to had to contact the seller again. They sent out another set. Um, these ones were all shaved. Um, so not like this. Um, and they all have, just like these ones, they all have holes through them along with a string that came with it so that you could actually wear each of the OM uh, symbols. And if you notice, they all look kind of different because each of these are made out of the uh, corresponding woods. Um, each of the corresponding woods for each uh, letter. Um, so, I, I mean, it's a really amazing kit. Um, but so that first set, the, the replacement first set, um, that was great. However, my dog at the time, not the one I ha currently have, but, um, our dog at the time got a hold of them and kind of destroyed several of them. <laughs> so that was a big bummer. 
and like a couple years later my husband bought me another set um and this time this time it came in with with the bark on it so um and this is kind of a prized um possession of mine i i use this fairly frequently um especially for my devotionals to um to my irish deities um yeah so i i'm a big fan of oem and um i've never uh memorized exactly what each of the things mean um but yeah so i'm gonna i might actually keep these in this bag and i might use the my new set in here or i don't know this is a nicer thing i think but with how i use my oem i like i said i liked well one i don't think it's actually gonna fit in there i don't think it is yeah, so that's kind of solves that. Uh, but I kind of, I, I really like the oversized bag for it. And because I kind of, you know, do this whole thing and pull out uh, a random OEM for my readings. So um, I'll put, um, actually, you know what? <sighs> what do I want to do? Because I actually don't like this bag. It's 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 the bag that came with it. Um, and I just never got a new one. <laughs> I never made a new one. So I'm trying to decide if I want to actually use the new bag this came in. This will have to go in here, of course. I'm sorry, this is turning on into a pretty long video. Uh, I think I'm just really excited about this. I This is right up my alley. And I feel like a lot of people probably wouldn't care too much for this box. But... This is something that I enjoy. So it's about the same size, but I don't know. Let me see if I can put them in there. I mean, this works. It, it The only problem is that it's kind of, it's see-through a bit. So it, I don't know. I'll, I'll put it in here and see how I like it. <laughs> we'll do that whole deal. So there's, there's my old set and here is my new set. All right, so I'm going to put these aside and I'm going to take a quick screenshot um, or, you know, quick picture for the thumbnail and there we go. Okay, so that's pretty much everything. I don't have these in there, but that's fine. <laughs> um, oh, my incense too. I'll just like sneak that right there. <laughs> All right, so... Um, that's it for this box. I'm actually really pleasantly surprised with this. Um, uh, of all the box boxes to accidentally get, um, this is definitely the one uh, that I would want. Um, and because there have been um, boxes that I haven't gotten that I, I've seen other people get. And I was like, ooh, I kind of would have wanted that one. Or I would have been happy with that one. And I've considered getting um, that box in their shop. Um, but then I never end up doing it. And that's probably what would have happened with this. I would have seen uh, what this box was and been like, oh my God, that one's perfect for me. Um, and then never would have gotten it. So um, so yeah, I'm actually pretty happy that I forgot to uh, suspend my account again for another three months. Uh, I have now. So uh, maybe I'll see, see you again in regards to The Witch's Moon in about three months. All right. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. And I will see you next time. Bye.